Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I'm Jacqueline, the Holistic Siren, bringing you physical, emotional, and spiritual healing. And this is the February 2021 health predictions reading for Capricorn. Okay, um, my final Earth sign in the zodiac. Okay, so a little bit about you, Cap, is you govern the root chakra. Okay, so that is like your foundations, your sense of security and stability, your basic needs, food, shelter, water, okay, um, your sense of belonging or what, um, like what group you feel like you belong to, okay, um, and your sense of safety. So in this reading, we are going to find out what is the health theme for Capricorn in February, what chakras you guys need to focus on, what forms of self-care would be best for this month, and then what your spirit team wants you to release and let go of okay so let's get into it um divine what is the health theme for, for capricorn in february what is the health theme for capricorn in february What is the health theme for Capricorn in February? Okay. Ooh. It's funny you guys got this card because in my head I was thinking like you guys are a little shy or introverted that you guys were watching this. And you guys got the Hermit card in the reverse. So contemplation and wisdom. I feel like you guys are needing to like, oh yeah, and we also got the page of feathers, which is exploration and discovery. So this is, for me, it's like an emotional journey, like self-discovery, self-exploration, like getting to know yourself a little bit. Um, It's funny that you guys are governed by the root, or you guys govern the root chakra because, as like I said earlier, it's your like sense of belonging, um, you develop that at a very young age and each chakra is dominant um, every seven years and your root chakra comes first. So from the day you're born to your the age of seven, that's when you kind of um, align with like your, um, like your group, your, the type of community you wanna be a part of, okay? Think of like cliques in high school almost, um, but much deeper than that. Um, so I feel like you guys are taking a deeper dive, um, into yourself, into exploring yourself, self-discovery, um, into your own well-being, um, and what you can bring to the world, okay? Um, and into the physical world, like Root Chakra is all about materialism and material things, and Cap, you are an earth sign, so you are all about that, um, okay, so, like, February is bringing a lot of self-discovery, and you guys are... I feel like you guys are going to need to take some alone time and like quiet time for sure um, to do the self-discovery and like this emotional growth that you're looking for. Um, I feel like you guys are also looking at like traumas from the past, like childhood traumas that are affecting your your health now, like your emotional health as well. I'm not getting like a lot of physical health, but I am feeling like gut issues, like like digestive upset, um, which can come from, which I feel like is coming from stress for you guys. All right. So divine, what chakras does Capricorn need to focus on? That was fast. Ooh. Okay. So the first card that came out is compassion and this is all heart chakra. Okay. So this is, um, how you give and receive love, how you love yourself, how you love others. All right. So I feel like this is very much like compassion for yourself, caring for yourself, accept acceptance of where you are and, um, acceptance of where you're going. Okay. Um, your life is a journey and there are no wrong turns. Everything is part of, of your life path. Right. Um, I feel like the the traumas that you're are, that you're dealing with are very much like from the heart, um, like someone not being compassionate toward you, or not caring for you in the way that you needed. 
are not accepting you for who you who you are okay and that directly affected so we have solar plexus so that is like your self your sense of self your self-esteem your self-worth your ego um your inner power so i feel like this is very this has been diminished for a very long time but it's almost like the self-discovery you guys are, are doing is trying to reignite the solar plexus like that inner fire that you have and you guys can do this on your own like you guys don't need anyone else like this compassion is coming from you it's not coming from other people because again you're taking a deep dive emotionally okay and now we're going to see divine what forms of self-care does Capricorn need to do oh okay so the first one is create art okay um I feel like I feel like this is going to be a really nice outlet for you guys like working with colors um that are calming to you uh just like getting energy out but in a creative way I'm also getting like a lot of inner child the solar plexus um represents inner child as well I feel like a lot of you guys used to paint or color or draw when you were younger um and this is something you're going to get back into in February um because it brings you a lot of peace which is something that you need especially when you're taking such a deep like self-discovery journey um okay and on the bottom of the deck we have burning bowl rituals so take a piece of paper write down everything you want to release from your past like past traumas um people who hurt you, toxic relationships, negative energy, um, low self-worth, low self-esteem, write it down and burn it in a very fire safety-esque way, okay? Um, because this is very symbolic of you emotionally releasing and letting it go, letting all that shit go. And finally, we're going to find out what you guys, what Capricorn needs to uh, let go of in February. Okay, so Divine, what does Capricorn need to release in February? What does Capricorn need to release in February? What does Capricorn need to release in February? You guys really don't want to let it go i feel like it's really deep like you guys almost don't know what it is but when you do the self-discovery you'll figure it out okay we have true love your wholeness and safety lie within not from a partner but this sovereignty actually leads to the deepest intimacy for you to stop using others let me stand on my own feet, dear Lord, and know true love. Okay, so I'm hearing like codependency here. Like you guys don't need to rely or depend on anyone else outside of yourself. Like the safety that you were lacking um, during childhood or your formative years, like you have that within yourself. And I feel like some of you guys might be older or feeling like you can't get past these traumas. Like they were so long ago, why are you not over it yet? You're, you're never too long to do the emotional work, okay? All right, Capricorn, so that was your reading for February 2021. Um, if it resonated, please comment below. I love to read your comments. Um, if you feel called to, you can also tip me through my Cash App, PayPal, or buy me a coffee. All the links are in the description box. I appreciate the energy exchange. You can also book a personal reading with me um, by sending me an email down below um, it is in the description box as well and um, I hope you guys have an awesome awesome February and I love you so so much